Once again, welcome back to SportX YouTube channel and today we are going to speak in the two incidents happening in the England game against the Denmark in Euro 2020 semi-final. The first incident was the two ball appear on the pitch and the second incident was the Raheem Sterling penalty. We are starting with the first incident as the two ball appear in the pitch but still referee don't blow the whistle to be kicking out the first ball. All in all guys, if you're watching the movement of Raheem Sterling with the way he's coming to the attacking position, we can never blow the whistle to stop Raheem Sterling for kicking out the other ball who was in not be considered to play or not be touched by any kind of player, even Denmark player or even Raheem Sterling in that position. All in all, I think referee don't supposed to be blow the whistle to stop Raheem Sterling keep attacking, but I think he, the decision of referee to stop to keep moving and then he, Raheem Sterling win the penalty is the right decision for him and the, it's not the right decision to stop Raheem Sterling to attack. Actually, in the second incident, it's about the Raheem Sterling penalty. A lot of fans he divided at the, as the Raheem Sterling diving, but for me, I think he, in that motion, when he was in the box as a striker or as the opponent who needed to win the games, was supposed to be careful like the way you're watching the Denmark. You don't be careful like the way you're watching Raheem Sterling and get penalty. For me, I think that's the clear penalty. No any, no any diving there because the Denmark defender touching Raheem Sterling inside of the box and Raheem Sterling not clear. Now I'm inside of the box. So any kind of touch is a penalty. And I think that's what we are looking for. And then clear gave England the penalty and the rim. and the hurricane never make a mistakes after being missed the first one and then he rebound to him and score it. All in all, biggest congratulations for England and the biggest congratulations for Denmark for the journey in having since the starting Euro twenty twenty. So please subscribe, like, comment and share. Don't forget to discussion on for my daily update. Ciao guys, enjoy my daily video. Peace out.